Hello everyone, you're welcome back again. We're going to solve for the value of x from this exponential equation. And the given equation is what? 16 raised to the power of x minus 1 divided by 4 raised to the power of x plus 1 is equal to 15. The first thing we're going to do, this 16, we can write this 16 in index form to the base of 4. This is going to be what? 4 raised to the power of 2 because 4 multiplied by 4 is going to give us 16. Then all raised to the power of x minus 1 over 4 raised to power x plus 1 is equal to 15. So the next thing we are going to recall is when we have x raised to the power of m to n, to the power of n, this is the same as what x raised to the power of n to the power of m. We can just switch the power. So this is equivalent to this. So we are going to apply this property to this place so that we can rewrite this as what 4 raised to the power of x all raised to the power of 2. So we just switch the power. Then minus 1. And 1 can also be written as what? 1 raised to the power of 2. Because 1 multiplied by 1 is still the same as 1. So we do this so that we can have difference of 2 squared. So everything now will be over 4 to power x plus 1, which is equal to 15. So if you look at this up here, what do we notice? We have difference of 2 squared. 4x 4 raised to the power of x all to power 2 minus 1 to power 2. So this is difference of 2 square. Recall that when we have a to power 2 minus b to power 2, this can be simplified as what? a plus b multiplied by what? a minus b. So this is the property we are going to apply to this numerator so that we can rewrite this as in form of this. So this is going to be what? 4 to power x represents a, then 1 represents b. So we can rewrite this as what? 4 to the power of x plus 1, then multiply by what? 4 to the power of x minus 1, then everything over what? 4 to the power x plus 1, which is equal to 15. So in the numerator, we have 4 to the power x plus 1, then in the denominator, we have 4 to the power x plus 1. So this and this is going to cancel. We are left with what? 4 to the power of x minus 1 which is equal to 15. Now, the next thing we are going to do is to take this negative 1 to the right-hand side of the equation. We are going to have 4 to the power of x equal to 15. And when this negative 1 cross to the right-hand side, become positive 1. So we have 4 to the power x equal to 15 plus 1 is going to give us 16. Now, the next thing we are going to do is to try to make the base to be the same. We have... 4 to power x, which is equal to 16 in index form to the base of 4 is the same as 4 to the power of 2, so that we can have the same basis. Now that the bases are the same, then according to one of the property of exponents, the power is also the same. So we can cancel out the base, then we just equate the power. The first power is x, which is equal to the second power, which is 2. So therefore, 2 is the value of x that satisfies this equation. Thank you for watching and please follow and subscribe for more video like this. Thanks.